Hi, this is Dr. Raju Kupchanani. I am a pediatric rheumatologist. That is, I look at children with muscle, bone and joint diseases and have been practicing this for about 20 years. I currently practice at SRCC Children's Hospital, Mumbai. Parents always ask, Doctor, but how did you confirm your diagnosis? Which is the test that you did? And this is a very crucial point to understand. Juvenile idiopathic arthritis is not a diagnosis which is made through laboratory tests. Juvenile idiopathic arthritis is a listen and look and examine diagnosis made on history, physical examination and bedside. The tests that we may ask for are actually not to prove juvenile idiopathic arthritis but to rule out mimics whether they be even x-rays or blood tests or imaging. Now you might have heard some of the tests that your doctors will ask you to do, HLA B27, ANA, rheumatoid factor. Yes, these tests help us in the diagnosis, but they help us in stratifying or classifying between the six categories that I spoke to you about. There is another bunch of tests that the doctors may do on follow-up. These tests are done to monitor the activity or how much inflammation is going on in your joints or to monitor the medicines that your child is taking to make sure that the medicines are not having any side effects. Mm -hmm.